So I've got Craig here with me today. We're gonna do four loco for the second time. We're gonna do it a little different than last time. Last time I just kind of went to the store and bought some random four locos. This time I bought pretty much every flavor of four loco. I've got a randomizer that we're gonna go and we're gonna use to tell us which ones we're, we're drinking today. Like all my other experiments, we're gonna chug these things, wait 15 minutes, breathalyze until we hit 0.08. Craig, you know what? I'll give you the honors, man. There we go. Here we go. Big money, no whammies. Red. All right, four loco red it is. Fourteen percent alcohol to volume again. I don't know if there's any other notable facts about this one. Thank you for the disclosure that it contains alcohol. Hey, Craig, have you ever had a four loco? Never even heard of it before. Oh boy, <laughs> we're in for a fun night. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers, sir. <laughs> What's your first uh, thoughts on this? I'm glad you asked. Have you ever had Harvard Mist before? No. Have you ever had Boone's Farm? Yes. Okay. Arbor Mist is like cheap, you know, cheap wine. Like, this tastes like Arbor Mist. This tastes like cheap wine? Yeah. Honestly, like, this is not bad. You don't like it? Oh, I'm not a fan. You haven't had enough cheap wine. You're right. I haven't had enough cheap wine. Oh, there you go. You're further along than anything. How do you think this compares to the other? Oh, it's better than the sour. This is delicious compared to the stuff I drank last time. Of the snozberries taste like snozberries. You can't chug these things. Are this 24 ounces? <clears throat> is that what it says? Mm -hmm. 23 and a half, same difference. All right, dude, I'm rounding up. Mr. Math over right? here. We already know how good at math I am. Mmm, that's my mmm face. Don't get it confused. With what? With my, this is a little gross face. Well, what's your, this is gross face. It is sour. It is sour. This is sour? It's not even, it does not labeled sour. Sorry. That other one was it's labeled sour. sour. That was my mistake. I'm, I done messed that one up. This is labeled red. And it is red. It is red. It's my it's tongue. Red. Is my tongue red? Huh? It's more red. It is red. Wait. I feel ripped off now. Remember I didn't even get tongue. blue tongue last time. CN15. It's been 15 minutes. 0.067. I guess we'll see where Craig's at. 0.059. I thought I could drink. You're in too good a shape, bro. What's your problem? You need to get like fatter and unhealthier. Metabolizing alcohol too fast. It's hurting your drinking game. Think about the important things. I knew I felt a little buzzy, but I'm almost at 0.08 after one drink. We all know what that means. Time to spin the wheel. We're gonna spin that wheel. What's his name? Big money, no whammies, no sours. Please, no sours. Mm. Please, no sour. Oh, Jesus, oh, it's gonna. Electric lemon? No! Uh, electric yeah. lemonade! Yes. We avoided the sours this time. That means the next time, yeah. oh, Dan or Doug, probably gonna have to deal with some sours. So we've got electric lemonade, still 14%. Mm. They ID. Oh. Who IDs? For Loco? Okay. It's so much better than the red. That's actually not terrible. <clears throat> the sour. Is there no sour? The electric lemonade is the one to go with. Yep. If you're feeling froggy. Nobody wants to punch themselves in the face unless you're drinking blue red or whatever the frost one was. Wait, I've not been able. Like? Frost? Yeah. What, what do you think frost tastes like? I think of like winter mint. Oh, oh no. no. Oh good God. Not peppermint? No, there's no not peppermint. Mint. I haven't seen Frost since I had it a year ago. Wait, you killed Frost? Apparently somebody saw my YouTube channel and then they canceled Frost. Yeah. My bad if you like Frost, but well, if you did like Frost, you should be off. punching yourself in the face every day. Don't punch yourself in the face. <laughs> that sounds counterproductive. You can get somebody to do that for you. Maybe you could make money. You could make money offering face punches. I'm an idea, man. I have a feeling this is what's gonna happen. Oh, I'm slurring a little. 
I'm a thousand percent per, per certain. Yeah. I'm nervous of what I'm at, actually. I think Carl's already over point oh eight. Everybody else's metabolism is slower than mine to begin. Maybe you're just lower body fat than everybody. Where are you at? Oh. I just have to move faster, that's all. I'm a pace yourself kind of guy. I'm not a chug. Who is like the first hot chick making music videos in my life? What? Uh oh. Man. I feel like a woman. Who remembers this music video? She was like walking around out in the desert with a cheetah. You have to keep me on task. All right, on task. That's what I'm saying. It's hard to herd cats, especially when I've been drinking. You're my cat and oh. I'm a cat, but we're both cats. I'm, I'm trying cat. to hurt us both. Ah! What is hurt? Why is cat hurting? Have you ever tried to hurt a cat? Yeah, I have a cat. I have a story for you. This is like Matrix. Oh, did the cat jump up and go <laughs> No. Okay. You think of the Matrix. What do you think of? <laughs> no. What is that even? Like, what the it was kicking. Oh, the cat was kicking. Yeah, the no. cat was. A, it was a cat kick. Okay. No, I was thinking deja vu. No, I don't think of that when I think of the Matrix. I think of the cat kick. No, but if I say, there's no cat kick in the Matrix. But there is now. What? This guy never even saw the Matrix. Clearly. Going back. Deja vu. Where you at, brother? Oh Jesus, you're that far back. Oh, you got a wise, you got a wise. You got a wise to go. There's like one drink. That's like drink and a half. It's sour. It's sour? Bitter beer face. What's taking you so long? 15 minutes, we're gonna find out where we're at. So stay tuned. <laughs> Your cheeks are rosy AF, you too, dude. Huh? Is my nose rosy? Oh, would they call you a nosy rosy? Nosy they did. Uh, I got some questions for you, Craggery. Oh. What kids movie soundtrack actually bangs? Listen, my kids love Frozen, dude. Listen, and it's not just Frozen. It's Frozen and Frozen 2. Can you sing a little bit? Into the unknown. Into the unknown. Wait, wait for it. Into the unknown. Is it possible for a person to break their foot while jogging to first base during a non-competitive softball league? You know what? I wasn't jogging. I was running as hard as I can because I always play as hard as I can. Wow, I'm offended. YouTube, cancel this uh, this channel. Carl you got don't canceled. Know who I know. <laughs> to answer your question straight up, it's possible, and I know this, and I know you know this, because I did break my foot. Playing softball. Next question. Which is your favorite Disney princess and why? Moana. Oh, Moana. Don't get it twisted. Moana's a princess. She lives on some like, it's like Hawaii, right? Like it's, you think of it as Hawaii. No, Hawaii is culture, okay? Well, I think they have, I've never been to Hawaii. Hawaii is culture, okay? So don't get it twisted. It's not just some like, rich destination place they have culture but moana has culture she likes chickens and like the chicken eats a rock and stuff and she loves the water and it's all about the ocean and stuff moana's cool just watch moana moana's a fun movie echo play moana movie. moana original motion picture soundtrack by various artists be careful because i might know the words moana Make way, make way. Moana is tiny. Alexa, can we turn it up? It's not Alexa. Liar. Problem is Alexa. Alexa uh, no, the problem. She's turning it Ale up right now. She's in that room. Alexa, turn it up. My wife. And my wife. My wife. My wife. And I'm my wife. Because I have a wife. Uh, Czechistan. Yeah. What was that? Apologies. Listen guys, Moana, it'll melt your heart. Moana's a fire I'd do better if I hadn't had two 14% drinks in me, okay? I'm not done with these. These questions are gonna happen. Oh, we were doing questions, I forgot. Right, questions. How'd I get this pen? Which, Craig, hey. Wait, I'm listening, I'm just- Craig. Hey, I'm I need you, I need you over here, brother. I'm multitasking, yep. I read and I look. Wait, I, I read and I listen. Which woodland creature do you best identify with? Ooh. And why is it the marmot? Oh, 
I was about to say a chipmunk, but then you said marmot, and um, they're in, I think they're in the same family. Not even close. No! Wrong. You can't even say they're not even close. They're definitely I close. can absolutely say they're not even close. The I've seen them both. I, one's a big one, one's a little one. Define big, all right? Bigger than this? That, it's smaller than that. It's, it's smaller, bigger than that. It's marmon is a big old thing. All right, I'm a big old thing. A marmon is not that big. You just done, no, gone, done, that's did it. Who identify with a marmon? Because we saw the hoary mama. You saw Hori Marma. Yeah, we went to Seattle and we went and visited the Washington Rainforest. There are rainforests in Washington. You probably didn't know that because you think of like hot and wet. The other way that you think of that. My question was why was it the Hori Marmot? Because I've actually been to their habitat. That's why. Why do you think the marmots are so carefree? Because they live in a great habitat. You ever heard of like Habitat for Humanity? I have, but I don't, I don't even know if that relates to what I'm the wait, point wait, I'm making. Wait, wait, what? I've got a picture. Moana, guys. Like, I have a picture I have to show you. Fuck! Fuck! Without showing- That's a hoary marmot, but they're allies, okay? <laughs> Can you describe to me what you were feeling when this picture was taken? Predator seeking prey. Well, obviously as a mormon, I'm a, I'm the prey. Sometimes the mormon is the prey. And there's an eagle in the picture. That's not just an eagle. That is a bald eagle. There is no predator that haunts the American bald eagle. Name one. Go for it. Dare you. Meanwhile, it's been 15 minutes. Let's see where we're at. Me first. Craig's first. Oh boy. Craig's Usually first. Let's see where I he's at. I open the door for my wife, you know, because I'm a gentleman. Tell me. Point one, two, two. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. You're welcome. Thank you. That's my. Oh, a point one, five, one. This is the crab from Moana. Ooh, ah, wait, eh, eh, eh. Ooh, ah, wait. If you ever look at the behind the scenes from Moana, pretty cool. The old woman in Moana is actually played by a younger woman. Two, four logos got us both over 0.08. Crazy. Well done, four loco. Alcohol is addictive, okay? Let's get that straight. If there's any questions that you have for future guests. If you want to hear me sing more of the Moana soundtrack, I'm willing. I'll see you next time. Cheers. We'll see you next time. Loco means crazy. Four locos and crazy. Four locos? Like cheap wine. You call me Fred Astaire. Two of these will mess you up. Speaking from personal experience, remember the times when you got wasted and you were like, I need water now. Boy, I feel like a P.U.S. I need water right now after two of these. Two. Uno, dos. No trace. Did you know the body is like 75% water? Whoa, science. Science. Educational and fun. Wow!